Hi. Today, I will block you and show you both of our points of view. Ba is the blocker and you is the one being blocked. First and foremost, when you block someone, they will not receive any notification, so you are safe to block people. Next when we chat, the blocker can't read your chat, but person being blocked can read your chat and still doesn't know that she's being blocked. Next blocker can send an invitation to the playgroup, but the one being blocked can send two, but the blocker won't be able to receive any notification this is the same when you summon each other. Next, the blocker can try to summon a blocked person, but there won't be notification for the blocked person. The blocked person won't be able to summon the blocker and will have this notification. Next we can both send hearts to each other. Next blocker can follow the blocked person, but the blocked person can't follow the blocker. Next, sending a letter, the person being blocked can't send a letter to the blocker. It says that the inbox is full, but I actually made space in my inbox. Now let's try to use the blocker to send a letter to the blocked person, it can be sent. Next when the blocked person tries to enter the blocker's house, it says that the owner is editing the house, but actually the owner is right next to you. Now can the blocker enter the blocked person's house? Yes! Next can the person who is blocked write on the blocker's guestbook? You can't, so this is the best way to check if you are being blocked, unless there's some sort of error that I am not aware of. The blocker can write on the person being blocked GB though. Oops I just realized that use video is not of the best quality. I forgot to change the graphic settings to be the best. Oh no! Next let's test if we will bump into each other in public. Let's pick a random house to meet at. I am not going to show you her name because I am Meanie. Actually after this video ended, somehow the owner kicked me. Back to the actual video dot dot. Oh your pet name is interesting by the way your pet is a beauty. So here we are at a random house party, we will still meet each other. This is a terrible thing because if you block the toxic person already, and you can still see them in the game, that is really bad. We have voiced out to Hajin already and hopefully they make these blocked people invisible. So that's all I tested, so now this is where and how you can block or unblock the players. This is where you would find the list of blocked people. Please subscribe to these people that I have blocked. And you can simply check their profile from here or unblock them. So here are some of the worries people have when blocking. If I block my friends, will they get deleted automatically? No, they won't, so feel free to block your friends temporarily and unblock them later enjoy your peace. And don't worry they won't get notified unless they try to follow you, enter your house or write on your GB. Can I block my partner? No, sadly we can't. Why do you block people? When they are toxic, bullies or spammers, like if they spam your guestbook or spam that plaza and cause you lag, just block them. 2. They don't read bios and cross boundaries. 3. To keep track of them when the idle list is full, but if this is how you keep track of them, don't forget that if they want to reply or talk to you, they can't. Sometimes I use the block feature to keep track of hackers, but once they change name I forget who they are. So I hope that we can somehow write a little note next to their name or profile so that I can remember things. That's all I guess. If you have any questions or things you are curious about or want me to test out, let me know. <laughs>